Hey everybody! So I am filming this on Tuesday night and I have to say, I just wanted to do a quick little energy update. Monday was really tough. I don't know if you can relate to it. If, if you can, definitely you can write it in the comments. But I felt like there was a lot of energy that was thick and heavy and people were more grumpy and being set off easy, including me, right? I don't know which came first, the chicken or the egg, because I, I was definitely taking on, taking on other people's energy. And then I found myself getting more like sniffy and stuff. So my own shit started coming up. Anyways, um, I ended up having some good personal insights um, which I'm grateful for. And uh, then before going to bed, I just felt so much emotion that just wanted to like, ah, come on, Judy, you're in the way, that just wanted to lie out of my body. And so I had an Epsom salts bath with lavender and I just needed to give myself that self-care. I allowed myself to sleep in a little bit. I didn't work out in the morning just so I could get a little bit more rest and um, it was definitely what I needed. So I hope if your body, if you were feeling more like Monday, I, I hope you've been getting some self-care to get yourself back into alignment. Uh, so the energy today I felt like was better, for sure, it was better. And oh, you know what? I pulled three cards at the beginning of my yoga class tonight. And I knew I wanted to pull some cards for you, and I thought, but you know what, I'm just going to share these ones with you because I feel like they are in beautiful alignment to share. Okay, so the first one is Goddess Siege, Quiet Time. So between now and the rest of the week, make sure you get some time to maybe meditate, to chill out, to clear your mind, maybe listen to Solfeggio frequencies on YouTube. That is spelled S-O-L-F-E-G-G-I-O or binaural beats. You can listen to that or guided meditation or do a chill yoga class. Um, something where you can clear your mind and, and, and get into your body. Uh, the next card is BAST, uh, independence. So make decisions that are for your highest and greatest good. Let go of fear of judgment of how others might judge your choices. We need to make decisions that are in alignment with the core of who we are, that uh, creates excitement within us, that creates joy, that feels like play, right? Make decisions that help us to feel in our strength and our power. And, um, it will not only shine or light bright, but also ground us down and draw to us uh, what we desire. The next one is Rhiannon, Sorceress. And this was upside down. So it's remembering, like maybe you have forgotten that you are a powerful creator and um, you can manifest amazing things in your life and you have brought in amazing things in your life. And it's about trusting and believing that you are all that in a bag of chips and that you can bring all that you desire in, in beautiful divine timing. So trust in the timing of things, but uh, build and harness that belief that you I'll just say it again, you are a creator. So I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week from uh, Chewy, from Chewy and me. <laughs> namaste, from my late to yours, namaste. Bye.